internet friends and fellow aviators. Short video today uh, showing what I'm doing and so uh, this week we're going to uh, be painting this spinner on my on this kit fox and so I'll tell you what I'm doing with this thing. Uh, this spinner is a, a carbon fiber and so it had a lot of uh, pinholes and pock holes and so I needed I felt I wanted to fill those um, with a with an epoxy of some kind instead of just using a high build primer and then paint it so I wanted to seal it first now when I worked for the uh, airlines and I did some composite work for uh, the airlines and the Boeing uh, manual um, listed this product as a sealer for um, composite materials and uh, I'll show you what it is it's a 3M epoxy adhesive scotch weld EC 1838BA green two tubes it's a little kit you mix it uh, by uh, one to one by weight, and uh, so uh, and so it. This is what it looks like once it's dry. Dries, dries pretty good. So here's uh, I put a very light coat. Using a very light coat, I uh, spooged it on here, and you can see where it filled in a lot of the um, holes and pinholes. And then I'm lightly sanding, what, just uh, sanding it smooth to the touch, making sure I don't get back into the um, carbon fiber. I have to be careful here. No more sanding here, so uh, we'll sand it smooth and then prime it with epoxy primer and then with uh, and then with the color that they they try to match the color, but it's uh, it's pretty close. Um, th this is the old spinner on the G that it had the GSE prop, and uh, this is the color. It's it's very close, and so. Uh, that's the color it's going to be. Match the rest of the plane, and so um, once once that is done this this week, I'll probably start with these uh, start with these uh, cow flaps. I don't want to put the, they, they're going to be like fake fake cow flaps all the way around. So uh, hopefully another month or so. I'll be done with all this stuff. So signing off again. Uh, it's a nice warm day here in Conroe. Uh, it's uh, Tuesday, the 17th, I believe. So um, you guys keep building, and we'll see you in Oshkosh, the Lord willing. Thank you.